Hello and welcome back to you. This is Lakshmi Kantiwari. Today we are going to create a CMSYS DSP library for the CC3200 launchpad. As you know, the CMSYS means the Cortex Microcontroller Software Interface Standard. By using the CMSYS code, you can use the CMSYS code throughout all the Cortex M series microcontroller. This is a very huge full library. So the before we start to build this library, you have to use these two files. This is the CMSYS file and this one is the this file is provided by the Texas instrument. Okay, so the let's see inside the CMC. This is the CMC, CMC RTX and the for the device. And this file is provided by the Texas instrument. We have to update our CMCs using these files. Okay, so the first copy this CMC file to your C root library, or you can copy this file anywhere. So the best way to copy this file to here, okay, and uh, then copy this file CMC, CMC DSP, and this source transform and the ARM bit reversal too, okay. Copy this file into the C, and then CMC, and then DSP lib. Then you can go into the source, and then the transform function, and then paste here, okay. If it asks about override, then override simply. Fine. And then go back. Okay. Go back to here. Then copy this include all these four files. Okay. Copy these four files. Again. Come to the C. And then here CMCs. And it was the include. Okay. Then paste here. If it asks about override, please override it. Okay, fine. All right. Now let's start to the create a project. Before creating project, please download all those two files and replace contained files to the destination. Okay, the first click on the project and then new CCS project and then CC3200 select Stellaris in circuit debug interface and type here CC3200 underscore underscore DSP select TI version 5.9 5.1.9 and then select here empty project and in the advanced setting please select here output type as a static library okay select here empty project then finish just wait okay right click and then go to the import and then import okay here select a general file system and then click on the next then the source directory go to the computer and then C then CMCS DSP lib and then select the source then click on the OK expand this select all but deselect this arm and the GCC and finally expand this transform function and deselect arm bit reversal to dot s file and then click on the phoenix go to into the advance and then create link into the workspace then finish then right click it and then properties let's say some properties here first okay come to the general everything is fine then arm compiler expand this processor option everything is fine just select here the vfp lib and then in the optimization select the second level of the optimization then include please include the cmc directory file so the add cmc's go to into the our the c file first here and then cmc's and then include click on the OK and then click OK here okay then leave everything as it is go to into the advanced op language option and then here support uh, this is the language option okay so here the enable support for GCC and then the predefined symbol select here these two symbols first one is the R math cortex M4 
okay and the second symbol the second symbol should be the fu present is equal to the zero okay and then diagnostic option deselect this the runtime model the place each function in a separate subsection click on the on and then advanced optimization leave it, it is as it is okay then assembler option select use unified assembly language and leave everything as it is okay no need to change all these things fine then into the arm archiver everything is fine don't worry into the debug also the everything is fine then click on the right click it and the build project So now, so now we are getting lots of error here, okay, and these error are the more than one storage class may be not specified and there are also the some warning. So removing, so to remove these errors, please change line number 53 into the linkage dot h, okay. So line number 53 is has defined underscore inline static underscore inline so change this line to the hash defined underscore inline and then inline okay the so copy it and then go to the linkage dot h okay you can find under the second include file so the linkage where is the linkage this is a linkage dot h at the line number 53 okay so this is a line number 53 comment it and add new file and then click on the OK and another thing for the warning OK update the CMC underscore CCS dot H file OK so go to the CMC into the second file here CMC CCS underscore dot H and what we need to we need to change we need to add these files OK so this is the underscore ROR so here what we can do here has define has define underscore this is the ROR underscore this is the ROR okay and the second one is has defined underscore sxt b16 okay Dep replace with the double underscore sxt b16 okay and then click on the save and then right click and the build one more time Now you can see everything, every error has been removed. Okay. And uh, now we can see the our library file has been created. Just see it. Okay. In the CCS version 6 and that was the CC3200. CC3200. Okay. To the debug. And the cc32000 underscore dsp dot lib file okay thank you so much for watching and uh, stay tuned for the next tutorial 
in the next tutorial we will be using this dot lib file for the next project thank you